Yeah, very nice bola. Got got the ghost once again. Another ult he goes down. Yeah, I think this game is just about wrapped up. There's only so much that the Zerkan can do. He's got a really nice build, which I think uh, is really the build he needs to go to be able to counter this team, this team at the moment. But the other team just has too many ulties and too much DPS they can put out. Too much ult. Yep. Again, seeing the cow uh, cow great in I was talking about that earlier, how uh, they were probably going to be in cow It's very effective. And uh, unfortunately, it counters a uh, Zerkan carry really hard. Once they see that Zerkan ulti, the, the cow can go and ulti that. That just really hurts. Ooh, Zerkan. Certainly going down, throwing the uh, residual storm back, but getting a nice OP off on the Lord Zerican before he dies. Yeah, I think what this game is really just coming down to is, is the fact that uh, the Zerg team really only has um, three heroes that, are, that can contribute to the fight. They've been doing a noble job, but they, they really uh, don't have enough. I'm not quite sure what the Rainer is doing, though. He's still level 11. That's what uh, that, that's sort of my comment, is that, uh, you know, Brax is a good player, but he he's playing a unit that just needs needs work, more work and development. It's not really a hero that can showcase any particular talent or skill at the moment. It doesn't put it out enough damage, and it doesn't really have a lot of escape mechanisms. Um, the Raynor, though, is not really doing contributing very much to the fight at all. So what you're really left with is a cow, a Raynor, and a Rancor, and a, and a Zerkan trying to carry the team, and it's it's not not really not really a pretty picture at the moment. They're doing a good job uh, as much as they can, and they're all very good players. But here you go, the third the attack for the cow. Gonna win. <laughs> yep. cow. Going, going. I, I think he'll get it this time because he has more DPS items. He's got yep. that black hole magnet. Yeah, he's gonna be uh, regenerating a lot of health and energy fast, but Lee might be able to come in and just steal it. No, he wasn't able to get it. I gotta give props to the cow though for uh, being persistent. <laughs> not, not giving up on the Leviathan. Bottom tower might get ninja. Nope, there's enough to defend it all. Ooh, and ulti. That black hole magnet sucking you into that ulti as well. He's going for the tower. Won't be enough. Too much DPS. Going down. That might be pretty bad. This might be GG. Nice rebounder. That's going to hit the rune creep. Oh no, rune creep drives right in top. Nice ulti snipe. And there's, yep. there's the uh, surrender. Well, it was a good series. Um, it, uh, let's see, Cerny, Atheist. Pull up the leaderboard here. Yeah, Cerny, Atheist, August Rush, MGT, Whale Tits uh, prevailed two to one in the series. Um, Got to thank the, these uh, these players for putting their time in to uh, let us uh, do this. Uh, it's been a lot of fun, and uh, hopefully we can do more of these in the future. Thanks, guys. Yeah, no, thank you to the casters. Uh, Death in Taxes and Mr. Brandon. And again, my name is a surgeon. If you want to just, you know, check out any of the VODs, they're all up on my Twitch TV channel. I'll be uploading mostly the important ones to my YouTube channel, uh, The Surgeon TV. And then, yeah, I mean, this game was great. This whole series was just great. Both teams being very well mannered, except for a little bit of uh, Garamon action there. I mean, yes. This is the beta, remember this is the beta, so we have to, you know, work out the kinks and hopefully make this a great game for everyone in the community. Any last words, guys? Yeah, this is just, um, it's been fun, and, uh, you know, I hope to see things like this uh, continue to elevate the profile of the community and help to make this a better game. Yep, those were three really well-played games from both sides. Okay, that's it for Sultans of Sodas week number three. Hopefully we'll see you next time.